Do you like mean riffs? Do you like nice people? Then you should check out Wise Blood Records right now if you want to check out some really cool quality releases with an awesome roster of bands on a small indie DIY label. Um, their latest release was by a melodic hardcore band called Sundown. Um, this is a really cool record. I'm getting ready to do a review of this on my channel. Uh, but I highly recommend you go check this out for yourself right now. This is not a paid ad and they have not even asked me to do this. I am doing this on my own free will because I love them that much. So go check out Wise Blood Records today and get yourself some mean riffs by some nice people. Hello everyone, welcome to Full Metal Gamer. I'm Jason, welcome to my channel where we discuss all things heavy metal and ironically, video games. Today we have a story that involves both. I can't believe that this is happening. We have some huge news that dropped today, so I'm just gonna get right to it. The um, streaming and music purchasing website, Bandcamp, announced today via email and then press release that Epic Games apparently bought them. So anyone who's not video game savvy or tech savvy, um, Epic Games is the creator of Fortnite and the creator of the Unreal Engine. So everyone's going to pay attention, is, is going to be hyper-focused on the Fortnite part, but they, but everyone should be thinking about the aspect that they own Unreal Engine. If you are unaware, most of the biggest video games that has been released in the last 10 to 15 years was made in Unreal Engine. So they are possibly one of the biggest video game companies in the world, and they just purchased a music streaming and purchasing website. It's no secret that, that Epic Games has an insane, insane capability of licensing and they are able to pull things off that not a lot of people can do. But let's read the story. I got this from Metal Injection, so we're going to read what they got here. And I'm going to point out the, the important parts of this, and then I'm going to tell you what my thought is. So, Music Marketplace and Sorta Streaming Service Bandcamp has been purchased by Epic Games, whose roster includes games like Fortnite and Rocket League. According to the Bandcamp CEO, Ethan Diamond, the site's functionality will stay the same while Epic Games will, quote, expand internationally and push development forward across Bandcamp from basics like our album pages, mobile apps, merch tools, payment system, and search and discovery features to newer initiatives like our own vinyl pressing and live streaming services. So, yes, they, they sent out an email, and I got this email today that basically explained all this. Um... It's, it's, it's important to note that most artists who use Bandcamp get to keep 82% of every sale on the website. So, yes, yeah, so, so when it comes to streaming and when it comes to music, you know, selling music from, like, from artists to, you know, fans, Bandcamp has, has been the go-to place because that's where you can make the most money. You make more than Spotify and everything like that, and their tools have was already great to begin with. And they started adding new features, like yes, they can they can press their own vinyl. They they have uh, they started doing a thing where they can have live shows, which this is huge. And I think this is what inspired Epic Games to buy them, in my opinion, because Epic Games has been even has been doing online like like in game concerts in Fortnite. They have this insane ability to license and get basically any character, any actor into that game. So if they buy a music streaming service, think of the possibilities that they will be able to bring to this. And now there's a lot of good that can happen from this. But of course there is a lot of apprehension and there's also a lot of skepticism around this too because... Fortnite was kind of the company that kind of started the whole microtransactions um, kind of trend in the in the video game industry, and there is a lot of fears, and there there are a lot of fear 
um, that I've been seeing that people are afraid that Bandcamp will get roped into this somehow. Um, but according to um, the CEO of Bandcamp, Ethan Diamond, um, he says that he's gonna he's gonna remain in charge of Bandcamp and the t the team operating it. Um, so basically, Epic Games is gonna provide at this moment more resources and um, I, I'm assuming you know just online infrastructure. You know, like I said, payments and, and other programs they want to add, they now have a huge cash flow that's going to allow them to do this because Epic Games is huge. They have a lot of money, <laughs> an insane amount of money. And now here's my own personal opinion about this. I think this could be really good in my personal opinion. But the thing that I'm kind of curious about is what does this mean for artists on Bandcamp and video games, could they possibly use this as a branch for artists to get their um, music heard and even put in video games? Because there is now this bridge that it, there, there was a gap and there's now a bridge. So this could be huge for artists. This could open up a whole new world of opportunity and um, just possibilities with with this with this merger so I, I and also let's also not let's not ignore the elephant in the room and this is can well no one really sees bandcamp as a a direct compared competitor to spotify and apple music with the backing of epic games there's this is a, there's a possibility that bandcamp could actually become up there with other um, streaming platforms, they could get a better app. I mean, they even talk about that here. They could get a better app that's more user friendly, like 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 Spotify apps and stuff like that. It's very possible. So I'm curious to see how this is going to go, and I'm curious to know what your thoughts are too about this. Let me know down in the comments down below. I would really like to know your thoughts and opinions, and I would like to have discussions with you about this. So anyway, one crazy news. I was not expecting to see this today. So thank you for watching my channel, everyone. Please, once again, if you like the content on my channel, please hit that subscribe button down below. Leave comments. Check out my links. I would greatly appreciate it. Anyway, have a wonderful night, everyone, and I'll see you in the next video of Full Metal Gamer. Always remember, long live heavy metal.